there, it's Jacqueline from Homeworks Etc. We're here doing a DIY tutorial on how to paint your front doormat. So uh, a few easy steps. We've got the doormat, our vinyl, and some paint. So here we go. First, you just wanna make sure that the transfer tape is on your stencil securely. And then you're gonna flip over your stencil and peel the backing off. Now you wanna peel back slowly just to make sure that there is no uh, black stencil on the back side. As you can see, it's all clear there on the white and then flip the stencil over. Now you've got some leeway where you can maneuver the stencil into position. And then when it's in place, just rub it down securely. You want that vinyl to adhere to your doormat. And then slowly peel back your transfer tape, making sure that the centers of your letters now adhere to the doormat. And you wanna to try to avoid ripping the vinyl in any way to keep the stencil design. You can just tear back smaller pieces. As you can see, we've done strips on this, but if you've got a full transfer tape on there, you can just rip and tear the top transfer tape to make it easier. Now we're gonna be using coal black from Fusion Mineral Paint. Uh, coal black is a very durable paint that will withstand the outdoors. So you're gonna apply a bit on your brush, uh, making sure not to overload the paint and just start stippling away to make sure all the centers stay in place. And you wanna do this over top of your entire design, one light coat before you let it dry completely and then add a second coat. Now, after you've applied a second coat, do make sure that it is completely dry to the touch before you start removing any of your transfer tape. And as you can see, it peels away quite easily. And then you're just gonna go and with your hands, just peel away all of those centers of your letters. And there you have your finished doormat. For more DIY tutorials, feel free to follow us and subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also follow us on social media at homeworksetc.diy.